Hello and welcome to Over the Vest Nurseries. I'm David Wilson here on one of our properties on a beautiful, fairly cloudy day in springtime. And I was here filming some other plants and I thought I simply have to take a picture of this and let you see how you can create very simple but yet very effective color combinations using some of the plants that you're likely to find at our partnering garden centers. And if you're looking for, I think, a dramatic, very cooling, pleasant color combination of bluish purple and clear crystal white, then this combination really caught my eye and I thought you would want to know about it too. You will see here that these are ornamental sages, salvias. They come out now in the early part of May, produce, as you see, a beautiful display of upright flowers. And if they're trimmed back, they will flower as much as two and three times a year. So you get repeat flowering with them. Now, should you be interested, this is salvia May night a really very popular variety that, as you see, does well. When you visit the garden centers, you're certainly likely to see this there, and as well, quite a few other varieties that come in different shades, and some of them at different heights as well. Ornamental sages are just beautiful, very reliable, and very good. But for me, the star of the show is this little evergreen azalea. This is Azalea Helen Curtis, an absolutely gorgeous and what's more, a really good performing variety. Right now the plants are only about 18 inches or so high. Eventually it'll probably be about two to three foot high by about the same wide. And when you look at it closely, you'll see that it is packed, absolutely packed with lots of these double white pristine white flowers that are carried in abundance all over its rounded habit. Now what's interesting about this plant is that it was introduced way back in 1968, so it's been around a long time. Tony Shamarello raised it in Cleveland, Ohio, and what's interesting is that he only introduced, he bred thousands of seedlings over the years, but he only introduced the ones that performed well in his fairly demanding climate there, and that means that this variety is a really good performer in our region here in the Mid-Atlantic and Northeastern states. Add to that the fact that this is such a beautiful, bright, white, clean, crisp white, and it contrasts so beautifully with the bluish purple flowers of the salvia. I simply had to let you see this so that maybe, just maybe, you might want to try some of these in a bed somewhere around your home too. This is David Wilson. Enjoy your gardening. It's good for us, and it's very good for our environment too.